right about probably a full wrap below the kneecap. Stretch it like that, all the way around. Straight and tight. See these red lines? You want to go to that line every time. Okay. You want to work your way up the leg, not down the leg. Well, how about leg locked up? I have it locked out the whole time. That's the whole idea of putting these wraps. You see how I'm just barely covering up that red line? See how tight it is? Yeah. Each time you get a few inches, you just stretch it tight. All the way on that red line. A lot of people will start crisscrossing when they get up here, like my old workout partner, Scott. You want to go all the way up? But I never. And then I get, like, there's the patella. I get just another full one all the way up it. And then each person is different, but I just kind of go back down. Like I say, Scott, he does a crisscross and all that. Well, that's, why, that's why people be... Yeah, this is... They about to die when, yeah. they, when they set it done. You see I this? feel the circulation. See, cut. there's a few inches left. If you wanted, oh, yeah, you get it all the way around like this, which is the right way, but I just tuck it on the top. You should barely be able to get some right there. Tuck it in there, and it's real tight. Forearm's kind of cramping. You want to get it to where you can pull it through so it doesn't pop loose. There you go. I always did it right on top of my knee. Really, the top of these is not in the right place, but I pull so much through that it's not going to pull loose. I usually like to do it on the outside of the inside of the knee. How's it look, Chris? How's it feel? Yeah, let's go squat. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah.